Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's episode, episode number 24 of our Hitman Island series, we are gonna be doing yet another weekly mystery signing. So this is like a, a sub series in this whole uh, you know RTG that we are doing because every week we sit and choose a particular player between player A or player B and we put them in a squad. Uh, this is mainly done for the people who are starting the game slowly playing fc mobile and you know trying to get the hang of it i'll just be telling you guys which player is better and which player i need in my squad and which player you guys should maybe go for it is purely an opinionated basis based video guys so uh, don't take anything seriously in this video this video is purely chill and uh, you know just to build your squad get some fodder cards if you guys are already having a massive squad to build now i will show you guys the squad that i build using mystery signings players only and then we'll actually get into this week's mystery signing i have no clue who these two are i have not seen anybody else you know uh open these mystery signings for this week so yeah here you go this is the team that we have built with mystery signing players so far a good 90 rated squad i would say because we have decent attacking i mean really she's a bit slow pace for my liking but it's decent but our right wing if you guys look at the right wing he has pretty decent pace and none of these guys have been upgraded to level 5 or to you know rank up 1 so these guys have pretty decent stats now the only two positions i would like to change is my right center mid and my goalie so apart from these two positions i'm actually pretty pretty happy with the positions that i've got uh, we got this card recently pretty crazy stats i would say if you guys have taken this card it is insane so now let us get into our mystery signings you know the whole opening uh fiasco now i'm pretty sure you guys will be having a at least a 94 or a 95 rated team by now and if you are not please be patient this game takes a while to get a hang off it is a pretty um, oh my god there is lag there is lag but yeah like i was saying there is going to be some it's going to take some time for those who think you know especially free to play players i am a free to play player myself and it took me a while to get a 98 rated squad let alone it took me a while to get a 94 rated squad let alone a 98 rated squad so be patient play every day you know you'll be able to get a good squad in no time now we get 90 rated martinez as our first player of choice a good card a good card you guys can go into this card uh, the pace is a bit low but it doesn't matter a really good card overall because he has four star weak foot and he has four star skill move apart from that he has 88 shooting and 88 dribbling guys that is actually some mental stats over there so for those who are looking for a different or a new striker you know you guys can go in for this especially those who have started playing fc mobile recently make sure you guys do mystery signings um, every week mystery signings is available and you get oh we get two strikers so no matter what we have to take a striker i think i have a good striker we have an 89 rated striker but oh Giroud. okay 90 shooting 77 dribbling now see this is a good example for between strikers as well you have two strikers same uh overall but have different stats this person has good pace good shooting and good dribbling which is what you would want in a striker to have those three main stats and he has four star weak foot as well uh he has 89 physical as well he is a bit short uh so you can't take a lot of headers with him but the same thing with Giroud, he is tall you can take crazy headers with him he can give a good shot he has 90 shooting but when it comes to dribbling and speed you guys can see that it's a bit low uh, compared to martinez but yeah it depends on what kind of striker you are looking for what kind of squad you're building around are you building a fast uh you know uh, what do you call that wingers and then you're trying to just have one number nine in the box always trying to get goals trying to get uh headers in then you can go for a player like Giroud. 100% a very good player but if you are trying to go down the middle and if you are like you are using your wingers just for you know support purpose and you know pass and play and if you are not having wingers if you are having right mid left mid and if your main players are your strikers then go for a player like Lautaro Martinez because 
he is good he can run straight at players he can dribble past players he can do all those stuff he has good dribbling good pace and good shooting as well there is only point, uh, you, there's only two uh, overall difference in shooting guys he has 90 this player has 88 so i would say both players are pretty good now i think i'm gonna go for martinez because i play a bit unorthodoxly because i i just play everywhere i just go everywhere so i think i'm gonna go for martinez you guys can also choose like this you guys can also build around players like this once you have your main center of attraction to your play style you can just build around players so yeah make sure you guys think about it and select players and if you're just uh, you know playing for uh, you just are doing these mystery signings for the sake of uh, getting free 90 rated cards then fair enough i am doing that also but i won't be use, using these guys in any uh, what do you say exchanges and all because we are trying to build a massive uh, mystery signing squad so that is one reason I, why i'm not using all those uh, guys in other exchanges where is he martinez actually you know one of the i think the best thing is to bring martinez here and then we'll keep forlan as our uh, secondary striker even though we have wayne rooney we have icon wayne rooney i think see this is the difference you guys can see a difference between 90 rated martinez and 89 rated forlan forlan has way better space he has better shooting as well he has he has a bit low dribbling and very less physical but these two players are very similar high pace high shooting and uh, good dribbling as well so these two players are very similar in uh, style and even rooney if you guys can see that the main stats dribbling pace and shooting can can go through the middle through defense easily so yeah we have still yet to get a better goalie than cobel but cobel is a pretty good goalie you know look at those stats very good reflex 90 85 handling 86 positionings 87 diving really good stats for a goalie and Mikel Moreno is a bit slow that is the one reason I want to change my right center mid but hopefully in the next mystery signing we'll be able to get a center midfielder my main squad I'll show you guys my main squad this is my main squad guys it's like the monster squad and my hitman Highland squad are uh, RTG squad this is the RTG squad so yeah there you go You've seen all my squads that I've built so far. I will see you guys in another episode or in another video. I'll until then take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and keep smiling. Bye bye.